Hello guys, my name is Ayatsen and today you will learn how to create custom items in the private server. As you can see, my first language is not English, so if you don't understand, just post question in the comments. First thing you need to know is how to set up the server. If you don't, just check in the description. To get this to work, you will need to have some softwares. Pine.net Starting as the WFD compiler, you can get it on Pirate Bay, Sharp Develop, and Notepad++. The first thing we will need to do it's open your client with sorting. Go into your server folder, copy paste this right there. Open the SWF. Click on the little plus right there. Go to image and find this one. As you can see there's already some custom items right there. You will need to export this image by selecting this and exporting. Open the picture with pen.net. For this tutorial, we are going to create a cloak. Start by selecting this cloak and copy paste it under the pink cloak. As you can see, my cloak is finished. We will save it. Go to go back to setting, right click, edit, and choose all file. The cloak is right there. We will save our client by clicking here. It's now time to cut the cloak. Go back to your server folder, type addition. Right click, edit with Notepad++, go back to the folder, find, next we are going to find that, right click again, edit with Notepad++, we are going to find a cloak by clicking on CTRL F and type cloak. We will use as template the cloak of plane walker. Go back, copy this and go back to your Addison folder. Oops. We will go up and copy this. This is the X value. It's not important uh, if you know or don't what it is. Just change the 6 at the end for a 7. As you can see, it's, it's a grow up at each item. Oh, as you can see here, I have found a bug. It's a 6 and now it's 7 and now it's supposed to be 8 because if if few items have the same X value, they will be the, the same in the server, so it, uh, it, it will bug. Just in the name of the cloak for a cloak of the, of the tutorial. And we are going to get the sprite we have put in the, uh, in the client, right there. Here's how it works. This is a sprite sheet. Each item have a value. So here's how it works. This is the 0, this is the 1 0, this is the 2 0, this is the 3 0, this is the 1 3, this is the 2 3, this is the 3 3. If you understand, you, you know this one is the 6 A. So we go back to the notepad. We change this because uh, as you can see in the sorting there's a many. A picture and this one is called Luffy object 6 right there and we are going to change this for 6a this is one of the funny part we are going to change the we are going to change the stats the bike type the fame bonus the MP coast the effect and the distance of the teleport of the plane and the cooldown if you want to create a really cool cloak, change the cooldown to 1, the MP coast to this, and, and change the description for something like a, a giant cloak of tutorial hashtag swag. Don't forget to save, open sharp develop, open your server solution right there. Click on the plus on W server 
click on anything to make the air to change to W server, click on build, rub your W server. It will take a few seconds if you have made everything correct, it will make zero errors. Uh, if if it gives you two errors, it's because the the, the, the server are uh, open and you need to close them before uh, rebuilding. We are going to launch the server to see if it works. As you can see, the cloak is made. It has an awesome cooldown, it takes less NP. And as you can see, you can now make your own items. Thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions, I repeat, you can just post them in the comments. Um, I'll be happy to uh, answer them. Thank you.